Can I help you? Huh? Can I help you? And who are you? I work for Reverse Lens. Okay, so. Stinging people's shit is what they're doing. Some of our, some of our things got apparently disposed of. Huh? Some of our things got apparently disposed of. Yeah. Well, they have a, they have a nasty habit. Um, my understanding from some of the homeless. Yeah, that's what they do. That's what they, they did. Is they came to where we were at in Kirby and they took all of our things and then they disposed of half of them. So we just able to pick up a few of our things. Right. Yeah, I've, I've heard they're doing that. I've also yeah. heard that sometimes they don't have that warehouse open. Oh, yeah. We and, uh... And so people can't pick up their no, stuff. No. No, we called and made an appointment and then we showed up. No, here. Right. <laughs> because a couple of people were COVID sick, they sold our things or they say they did not. Yeah. Well, they're supposed to hold it for 30 days. And if you, if you contact them and say, hey, check this out. We can't come in, then they're supposed right. to... We make an exception, right? Yeah. So, uh, they got you know, people sick with COVID, and because of them being sick, we lost our food. Yeah, see, that's not cool. Yeah, they've been doing this for years. I've, I've heard complaints that, uh, you know, they found jewelry and stuff like that, and they just sold it. So... Yeah. I don't want to talk to you, dude. As far as I'm concerned, Rapid Response is a fucking fascist organization that picks on homeless. No. As far as I'm concerned, Rapid Response picks on homeless. number is 971-275-0660. Okay. So... I can't even begin to describe how the things go over here. I mean, yeah. the house is open and you can take literally whatever you want. And so people came through and I'm sure they've taken things that are not theirs. Yeah. And, and uh, we've seen tags being swapped, tags like that. We've seen on our things, somebody already got it ready for them to take, you know, from a different street. Uh -huh. They say that it's uh, marked specifically for you, but it's so easy to swap them, so somebody was swapping them, right? Right. Well, that's what they would do is they, yeah, definitely, definitely swap the stuff. If you got something valuable, just throw another sticker on it. So, this is what he's talking about. Is this yours? Yeah. This is what he's talking about right here. Were you, uh, were you guys at Hayden Meadows? Yeah, we were. His neighbor was shot on curb. But this one's right here. Uh huh. This one right here was the new was, testers in all the time. Uh, see, that's not ours. Somebody switched it. Uh, huh? Yeah. Someone switched it here. I'm not sure. Well, yeah, it had yeah, to have been here. Yeah. That's yeah. ridiculous. Some, somebody wanted to. I mean, uh, well, but it's that was unknown probably, whether. Uh, not one of these guys. Yeah, it was. Could have been somebody coming over. Whoever lived yeah. on 20th and Hoy. Right. They just wanted that toolbox on top of Right. Well, these guys are responsible, so right. if someone goes in there and right. takes their stuff right. off, if someone yeah. goes in there and... Absolutely. That's exactly what I'm saying. Like, we were allowed access there. We could have taken whatever we wanted, and that's what I'm saying happened prior. Somebody uh -huh. came and did a little switcheroo, uh -huh. you know, and... But, yeah. And it's unknown. They can't... They don't keep track of 
probably thinks they were missing what's gone and what's not. They just right. say, oh, well, we got rid of it, or it got the auctioned off. I don't know. Right. You can never get away. Oh. So as you can see, things are switched. Um, and they're switch and tags are switched in the warehouse. That's their warehouse. <laughs>